Streamlabs is sponsoring me to teach you how to take a YouTube clip or Twitch clip and post it on social media quickly and effectively, edit it up super fast using the power of cloud editors. It's so much faster this way. Let me just show you how it works. Here's the too long didn't watch version on how you get a TikTok worthy clip done fast, right? So you're gonna grab a clip on YouTube use the YouTube clipping function, or grab a clip on Twitch using the Twitch clipping function. You're gonna copy that URL. You're gonna bring it over to crossclip.com, and then you are going to drop that URL right here into the bar, right here in the center, and paste it. Then you're gonna hit Get Clip. When you do that, this editor is gonna pop up, and it's gonna allow you to edit that particular clip and format it for TikTok. You're choosing the TikTok format here. Once you edit the piece of content, you'll hit compile. And then once you do that, it essentially renders your video for social media on the cloud and boom, it's ready to be posted on socials right here. If any of that didn't make sense, I got tutorial videos on all of that on the channel from making the clip itself here to posting it into CrossClip to editing it here on CrossClip to get the final product using this cloud editor all of those steps in great detail. Watch those catch up to where we're at because we're ready to post on TikTok now. So you're gonna see the sharing function here on desktop. When you hit that, there's no TikTok, obviously because this is just a link to your clip. It's not the actual clip itself. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is have the um, cross clip mobile app. It's free, just download it. You just log into your account and boom, you'll see all your clips that you made on desktop automatically imported here onto mobile. So once you do that, then we'll select one of the portrait format clips, which is what we're gonna want uh, for TikTok. And there's two different ways to post on TikTok using this clip. So you can use the pink sharing button at the bottom, and then you can scroll down and go ahead and find TikTok here in the list of apps and click TikTok. It's going to automatically par parse that content, bring it over and allow you to post normally on TikTok as you see fit. It's probably the fastest way, honestly. Or what you can do is you can just pull open, you can go from cross clip and just manually pull open TikTok itself. And then, hey, there's my sister on TikTok. And then you hit the plus button at the bottom of TikTok. And then you allow um, the application to have access, of course. And then what you're gonna do is click the upload button down here in the bottom right. And then what we're going to do is choose the clip here from our videos, hit next, and then boom, there it is. It gets us in the same spot. Plus button, square in the bottom right, there's our video, got it? And so what you can do is edit your video and do what you'd like with your video per normal. You can trim it just like you can do anything else on TikTok. Uh, and then it's going to process your video and upload it from your phone, get it on TikTok. And then you can add text and stickers and everything you could ever want to your TikTok video, even add sound to it, of course, which is what you wanna do. This is not a video that, that is all about TikTok optimization. It's just showing you how to post on your feed. You're gonna hit next. You're gonna describe the video and then you're gonna post it and select a cover photo the way you normally would on TikTok. Uh, and there are plenty of tutorial videos out there that show you how to optimize your content. But that is in a nutshell, how you can take it from the location that you have on your computer uh, or on the internet, on YouTube, on Twitch, run it through the cross clip editor, get it on your phone so that you can then post it on TikTok as quickly and effectively as possible. It's super easy, can save tons of time, and I recommend this method to my digital consulting clients. I highly recommend sitting down, cutting like five to seven clips in one session, getting them all on the cloud on your phone, and then just rolling them out on TikTok on a daily basis or whatever from your phone casually so you can be in an editing mindset one day and then just post throughout the week and not have to sweat making more clips in the future. Got it? That's how you can keep your Instagram, uh, your TikTok feed full of great content using CrossClip. Links below if you wanna check out CrossClip. It is free to try out and it is free to use with some paid features. Thanks to Streamlabs for sponsoring this video. Adios creators.